Good morning, everyone, and welcome to your 19th, hard to believe, reach back of grade 8. <clears throat> we only have two more after this, so we're on the home stretch, people. If you'd like to download a copy, you can go to tinyurl.com backslash reachback 19 g 8 Download a PDF version and work from there. Uh, a lot of people aren't taking pictures of the work, but make sure you do and send it to your teacher. Say hello. Your teacher would love to hear hello from you. Something. Uh, and here we go with the questions. Question number one, 13 ninths is less than one decimal four with a line above it. What does that line mean? Of course, it means a repeating decimal. Question two, the square root of 25 plus the square root of 24 is equal to the square root of 49. Is that true or false? <clears throat> Question three, two-sevenths divided by a quarter is less than two-sevenths multiplied by a quarter. Is that true or false? It's a true little thing. Question four, five times negative four minus 10 is a greater value than five take away negative four divided by negative 10. Question five, a cube with an edge length of 10 centimeters has a surface area of a thousand centimeters squared. Question six, the value of X in the equation, X divided by negative five minus two is equal to negative two. The value of x must be negative in that equation. Is that true or false? Oops. Question 7. The value of x in the equation, negative 2 times x minus 1 is equal to negative 4. We'll have a positive x value. Is that true or false? Question 8. 3 and 3 quarters is greater than 15 sixths. True or false? Look at that. I did that again. Bring this little guy down here. There we go. Question 9, the cost of an $8 car for 22% tax is less than $10. True or false? And finally, question 10, if a $24 hat is discounted 5% and then charged 10% tax on the discounted price, it will be more than $24. Is that true or false? As always, show all of your work. Make sure you don't just say it's true or false with no explanation why. Take a picture of work, send it to your teacher. Maintain good social distancing, wash your hands frequently, and as always, don't let those boomer parents of yours drive you crazy.